When we took office, let me remind you, there was virtually no international pressure on Iran. We were the problem. We were diplomatically isolated in the world, in the region, in Europe. The international pressure on Iran was stuck in neutral. Vice President Joe Biden there going off trying to blame the Bush administration for failures to stop Iran's drive toward a nuclear weapon. The fact is the Bush administration pushed four resolutions through the UN Security Council calling for Iran to halt its nuclear program. And the last three ratcheted up the sanctions against Iran. So did the media go after the vice president on this one, Kirsten? I mean, he never lets facts get in the way of a good, you know, anecdote or story. And I think part of the problem is, is because he does this so often, there's this attitude of, oh, there he goes again, and there's no, so you never have to report any of the things that he says. And the media let him get away with yeah, it. If, if they applied the same standard to Joe Biden that they applied to Dan Quayle, for example, over the misspelling of the word potato, then he, <laughs> uh, Biden, would be a, a raging idiot, uh, and Quayle would be an intellectual. I mean, this is this is so. Everything he said is so objectively untrue that somebody in grade school could have put holes in it. 